Come out. This is our wonderful new apartment. And that's Daryl in the bushes, as usual. This is our patio. Behind that door is the washer and dryer. Kind of sucks. We have to go outside to wash clothes. And this is my wonderful swing that I can now use again. And I put it together by myself. We all sat on it and we didn't fall on our butts. Now, let's go inside. Fish tank's covered up to keep dust out. But that's supposed to be the kitchen area, but it is our office. That is our kitchen. Ugly but functional. As you can tell, we don't have a sofa, but we make do until we get our chair back. That is our front doors over there. That's Daryl with the TV. This is the master bedroom. My dad broke both mirrors now behind the bed, so we just have wires hanging down. Not a large room. Gotta cover up that window. TV. And now we're back outside again. Oh, that's the bathroom, but it's not very interesting. So, let's walk down the hallway. And let's go see Daryl's room. That is Daryl's homework area. That is Daryl's bed that he finally slept in all by himself. Twice. His nightstand with the lamp we got from the thrift store for $4. All of his trophies and karate stuff and a ratty old blanket up there. Hey, it's not ratty. And got his TV and his PlayStation and all his books. Okay. And we'll unpack those boxes when we manage to get the shelf up. Now, let's go see what Devin is up to. This is Devin's room. Apparently nobody is home, but as you can see, just like the house in Baton Rouge, she's messy. Very, very messy. <laughs> and angered at being woken up. Look at this room and she said all that mess was Daryl's. Look at that. She gets the dogs and she gets the computer, which she's stuffed all her stuff into. She has two closets, which is not fair, but you know, what can you do? It is fair. And she gets her own door to the bathroom. Get out the way, you two. I get my own door to the bathroom, too. Walk which I told her to clean up earlier today, but then she decided she wanted to put makeup on, so she destroyed it again. We have fish. And she wants to show her closet just simply because it's a large closet. And when they're bad, I can just lock them in. And that is pretty much all there is to see in our apartment. So right now we're going to go outside and see if we can find the cats that have adopted us. Outside the parking lot is a playground that Daryl can go play on and you wouldn't believe the number of children that are out here in the evening time. Daryl's currently hunting for Elvis the cat. 
and baby. We don't know where they went, but they seem to have adopted us and like to live on our porch. See you guys later. No, it's saying please wait. Okay. Hey, there's Elvis. He likes to sleep on my swing. Where'd he go? Well, say cheese, Elvis. I love cheese. He's very cute. He's very friendly. And soft. And he likes magic. Go figure. Nobody else does. <laughs> I don't know where baby is right now, so we might get a picture of him later. We're off to the dog park. This is our doggy park. Rather large. Let's go inside. This is Daryl's school. Tips Elementary. It's very long. It's huge. This is the back of Devon's school. Well, that's because um, it, I start on Monday. it actually has what passes for a football field. I start on Tuesday. But you might get to go to some football games this year. Yeah. 